Breaking news out of Cincinnati, Ohio. Hall of Fame NFL running back Kendall Carter has gone missing from his home. Police arrived at his house after being notified of his disappearance from loved ones after he did not answer his phone for a few days. A key witness at the Retro Bowl Hall of Fame has also noticed that his Hall of Fame card has mysteriously vanished. The Bengals have a pivotal Sunday night game against the Cleveland Browns, and Coach Yamam has declined all media availability for the week. If you have any information you think would help the case, please submit to 1-L-O-U-S-A-S-S-O-L-E. Bengals fans, please rise and direct your undivided attention at the video board to commemorate Kendall, the Kangaroo, Carter's career. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna take Carter, Kendall Carter, right here. Reminds me of CJ Two K. Watching film on him, you know what I'm saying? Seeing him at the combine, he ran, he ran a four two five. All the way, Carter. So yeah, he's not a little bit. He was bigger, stronger, faster than anybody. I watch games in which they could not get that man on the ground. There you go. Now get him to hop over. Yeah, there you go. That's the Kendall I know. The Kangaroo. He's 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 hopping. I wanted to give out heartfelt condolences to the family, the loved ones, um, in the sports world, because we lost a great one today. One of the greatest running backs, universally recognized as arguably the greatest running back in NFL history for a long, long time. He was a guy that knew where he came from, never ever forgot where he came from, and conducted himself in that fashion at every turn. Just keep feeding him. They can't stop you. They can't stop him. They can't stop him. Exceptionally talented. Um, speed, quickness. Kendall can go okay, root. But he be hurt all day. Defender. His productivity is, is, you know, really been unmatched. It's very difficult to uh, simulate, you know, a level of that. A type of player with that level of talent. Yo, Kendall! Yo, Kendall! How did Kendall catch it? Kendall, run! Run, Kendall! Run! Run! They won the Kendall, championship Kendall, because of him. Yeah. He just dominated the league. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm emotional. Kendall Carter, one of my favorite players of all time. My first season back in Cincinnati, I did not expect something like this to happen. This game is in honor of Kendall Carter. Boys, we need to step up. Quiet locker room before the game, all right? Guys, we're emotional. B. Hall, who is his ex-teammate, the one-two punch. He's here to play for Kendall Carter. B. Hall, let's get it started. Let's go. Come on. Deep post. Freddie Griffin. Freddie Griffin. Break out. Break out. This is for Kendall. This is for Kendall. This is for Kendall Carter. Touchdown, Bengals. Do it for Kendall. Everything this year is for Kendall, man. Oh, my God, Walton. He wasn't here when Kendall was here. He, they, none of this defense was here when Kendall was here. They, they don't care. They, they, they just don't. They don't, they don't care about the heritage. Absolutely disgusting. Lowry. Low, Lowry was his teammate. And he's out here not doing it for Kendall. But Freddie Griffin is doing it for Kendall. Freddie, make a move. Please make a move. Oh, my God. Oh, man. He's smiling down from the heavens. He is smiling down from the heavens. Watching B-Hall still dominate. Come on, throw it up high. Throw it up high. <laughs> was that for Kendall? That, that, was, that ball was for Kendall right there? That, that, that was for Kendall? <laughs> Absolute disaster. Oh my god, and they scored two plays. Oh, this is actually embarrassing. We're not losing this game. You can't lose. This is the one game you cannot lose this year. I don't care. Come on, man. Stop playing. Stop playing with him. B Hall, let's go. First down. Stop the clock. God, I'm still emotional, man. I'm still emotional. B Hall making plays out of bounds. Oh. Oh, hit Freddy G. Freddy G. Freddy G came to play. Freddy G came to play. Stop the clock one more time. See if we can get a splash play. Oh, no double team. Yes, no double team. No double team. No, my quarterback doesn't care about Kendall Carter at all. Come on. Come on. Come on. Through the uprights. Through the uprights. All right, we'll take it. Down by four and a half time. Embarrassing! Please! Somebody step up! Oh, thank you. Okay, down by seven here. Halfway through the third. Come on, man. We gotta make plays. We gotta make plays. Freddie Griffin, he cares about Kendall. He doesn't even know him. He doesn't even know him, but he cares about the badge. Not your Phoebe Hall. Not your Phoebe Hall. Not your Phoebe Hall. Oh, B Hall's on the top of the screen now. Wait, how? They switch mid play now? You know what? Let's rocket it for him. Let's rock. Hard on. We're hard on. Run for Kendall. See, that, 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 this is why I haven't given a hand off all day. I just, that, that, just not honoring Kendall the right. Kendall, that's 13 yards per game. Third and 10. Third and 10. Teto, teto. Oh, somebody's gotta come down with it. Now oh, we're going for a fourth down. I don't care. 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 One on one with B Hall. I don't care. Fourth quarter. 
fourth quarter. Fourth quarter. B hole again. B hole again. 16 yards to cut. Why did I call timeout? I one. can't think straight right now. Oh, they're still setting the one on one. They're still setting the one on one. It's disrespectful. We're going for two here. We're going for two as well. We're going for two as well. We're going for two as well. I dropped my phone. Defense, pull it together, man. Do it for him. He's watching. I can tell he's looking down from the skies. Come on, watch it. Up. Please, man. I just want to win this game. Please, Stu Bear. Somebody force a turnover. Oh, Lowry. Oh, my God. Down by seven. 58 seconds left. Guys, no, I'm serious. We cannot lose this game, man. We cannot. Oh, Freddie Griffin. Freddie Griffin. Make a move, Freddie Griffin. Okay, he's trying. He's trying. Clutch. Get clutch. Get clutch. Get clutch. I might cut him. No, I'm... Wow. 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 Wow, 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 what? We're, we're, no, 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 he got paid. No, we gotta investigate him. No, he's gambling. There's no way. There's just, there's no, there's no chance he just did that. That, that's one of my worst losses of my career. 29-19 against Cleveland. They come in and ruin the show. That's just embarrassing, man. I don't even feel like playing Rushable anymore, man. All right, I'm back. I had to take a breather. Uh, the game was just pissing me off. Look at this division, all right? It's tight. It's tighter than your mom, all right? And we got to play Baltimore, our biggest rival right here. The owner wants to meet with me. See, this is a big game. What future plans could you be discussing with me besides the game ahead? I'm going to meet with my gal Beasley right here, but let's get into it. I took a break for a reason, all right? I cleared my head. You know, I wasn't playing the best retro ball that I could felt like I could put out there. Let's go. We're in the rain. Come on, Walton. I need you to show up. DPOY. Do you want that DPOY, Walton? Do you want the DPOY? Or do you want a BLT? All right, here we go, guys. Offensively, you know what? I'm implementing a new uh, a new approach to football. You know, I'm trying to be transcendent. I'm trying to be revolutionary. You know what I mean? I want a new theory, modern football theory, like I'm Pep Guardiola. And it's called passing to your running back out of the backfield. You know what I mean? Not a lot of teams do it like me. You feel me? It's essentially a system that's built on passing to the running back. No way! There is no... He, you, 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 so hold on. Bro really went for the interception. Behold, 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 behold. They send the blitz, but I smelled it. I smelled it. I knew what was coming, and now you're gonna have one on one. Now you're gonna have one on one. Baltimore, how many times do I need to teach you this lesson, John Harbaugh? 10 seconds left. Baltimore sends a blitz. <laughs> I might be regressing. I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below. Am I getting worse at this game? Because how the hell did I just miss that? How, how, that was a touchdown. That was a touchdown. Just kidding. I'm going to get a touchdown right back at you. You didn't take All the way. Buzzer beater. Come on. Come on. Keep going. Let's go. All right, back to my modern football theory. So, you know, we base it out of passing to the running back. Essentially, the theory is that when a linebacker is so focused on the running back getting a pass, that opens up the deep ball to Brendan Hall. Because then the linebacker starts sinking, you know what I mean? And they blitz less often, which opens up more passing lanes. But then if I miss the passes... See, now it opens it up. Now it opens up multiple lanes, open receivers. In this theory, it's, it's going to change the complexity of football. Football, you know what I mean? Because now people are gonna be studying my film and seeing how I change the game. You know what I mean? Because it's that easy. It's so easy. That's more like it. That's for Kendall. All right, last game of the video against 10 and 3 Steelers, the number one team in our division. I'm pretty sure we lost them earlier in the year. We lost 32 to 30. We gotta get a revenge. All right, we gotta get it back in blood, like who Shiesty featuring Lil Dirt. Defense. 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 Defense! 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 Okay, all right, you know, was that worth it? 48 yard field goal, 8-6. This is such a boring game. You know what, let's do, let's do a new segment with the Retro Series, all right? Story time with Hefe. So the other day I was uh, selling a laptop and I meet up with this guy at the train station to sell a laptop. I go up to him and, and, and he's next to this really, really big Indian dude. Like he looked like he could eat me, all right? He was that big. So I said hi to the guy and the guy asks me, can we test the laptop? in my car. I'm like, whoa, 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 you want me to backseat? What the hell's going on here? You know what I mean? Uh, it's kind of sketchy. I was like, nah, 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 let's do it on this bench. What? So I started getting a little sketched out. I was like, what the hell? This is kind of weird, but whatever. I put on my e-transfer and keep in mind, this guy is wearing like fake Louis V shades. He's got like pink Yeezys on. I don't know. There's something off about this guy. He's got a weird mustache too, but you know, whatever. Did he just fuck? 
Are you serious? What? Are you serious? Oh, I can't even finish my story. Guys, 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 man. Come on, guys. Yeah, on this drive. All right, modern, modern football theory. 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 Oh, my God. You got to get out of bounds, though, Warton. The rookie IQ lacking there. Oh, that slant's wide open. Great route by B. Hall. Great route by the route master. Stop the clock once again. Down by eight. Got to find B. Hall. Got to find B. Hall. Got to find B. Hall. He's wide open again. He's wide open again. He's just a route running genius. He just knows all the angles, all the cuts. He knows how to use leverage. Oh, okay. We got a man advantage. Freddie Griffin, don't fumble. Don't fumble. You fumble. I swear to God, I'll cut you. They turn the blitz and they change the play. All right, we got two up top. Got two up top. That's wide open. One of you. Okay. Event. Event. All right, cool. Overtime. Hold on. Let me take a break. So anyways, he sends me the money. Perfect. He opens up the laptop. Nothing was wrong with it. I'm like, cool. I'm gonna go home. I walk away, you know, I, mean, I think a couple shoulder checks just in case, you know, the, the big dude was gonna run down at me like a barbarian from Clash of Clans. It was all chill until I went up to my apartment, started cooking, and, and, and all of a sudden, all, I get all these texts. This guy just starts going at me, like, calling me a scammer, saying that I sell lock laptops. I'm like, what is this guy talking about? What do I do here? So I tried to help the homie out. Being the nice guy that I am, you know, I, I started searching up articles. I, I started freaking out a little bit, you know what I mean? Because he started saying like, hey, hey, I'm gonna call the police on your ass. Like, you better watch out, you know what I mean? And I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. So then we started going back and forth. I'm like really genuinely trying to help the guy as we win the game on a B-Hall touchdown. It seemed like he was rushing me to send him the money back, which I feel like is a common sign of a scam. So I was like, hey man, take it to the police let him know and yeah he never messaged you back since then uh every time i leave the house now though i definitely do a couple shoulder checks while i'm walking down the street you know i i just want to make sure anyways that was story time with hefe we won the game next video is gonna be our last three games of the season until we head into the playoffs if we make it thank you guys for watching rest in peace kendall carter